Welcome to Shelter Mode, the premier YouTube channel for shipping container projects from around the world. In this video, we bring to you Mostra Container House in Curitiba, Brazil. Stay tuned to find out more about this amazing shipping container home. Welcome back. Built with the use of shipping containers and a steel frame structure, Mostra Container House was brought to life by EcoHome Construction Company designed by Claudia and Daniela. It is built using seven shipping containers to create about 375 square meters of habitable space distributed over two floors. The containers sit on concrete piers topped off by a concrete beam all round. This foundation type elevates the containers of the ground away from moisture. The ground floor has got four 40-foot shipping containers that accommodate the rooms of the three family suites and Three containers are stacked on the first floor level and are sheared horizontally to create a cantilever over the ground floor. The front of the house is built using a steel frame to complete the residence. Each space in the house was designed by one or two architectural design offices, but the entire group worked together to find solutions of building with shipping containers to help each other in the execution part of the house. The symmetrical facade in gray follows the minimalist proposal and from the outside, it does not reveal the shipping containers which form the building blocks of this amazing house. However, the side facade in front of the forest shows off the shipping containers painted in an ice tone. The home's front door opens up into a lavishly decorated living area, which features several sitting areas for comfortable lounging, pieces of artwork, and an imposing European model fireplace. Past the living room is a generous and hospitable dining area with an oval lacquer table that offers fluidity and movement in the dining room. One of the containers on whose open doors invade the space at a height of the second floor has its container walls left in its raw state to celebrate the industrial charm of the shipping container finish. The high ceilings create an internal sensation of openness, airiness, and spaciousness, creating an amazing feel of space. Past the living area is a restroom designed with porcelain tiles that imitate black marble covering all the walls and floors, generating geometrical shapes that reinforce the design concept. The U-shaped kitchen is fitted with state-of-the-art appliances and lots of storage and counter space to enhance function and usability of the kitchen space. Next to the kitchen is a lovely breakfast area that has a mix of urban characteristics with contemporary, maintaining the structure of the containers to enhance the industrial charm. The pantry and the barbecue areas are custom designed. Sitting areas have LED luminaires which create a scenic and sustainable lighting. Large glass windows allow total opening or closing around the barbecue area. The door past the Zen space leads to a spacious accessible bathroom, which has a walk-in shower, a toilet, tactile elements, and artwork with color that has been used exclusively. The white door from the bathroom leads to a laundry room where the color palette used favors more urban colors such as concrete and dark blue, which bring personality to the service area. A small TV room features a sofa 
that is a great rest area for the family, while the highlights of this welcoming space brings in the concept of integration between the elements of nature. A sizable girl's bedroom has a comfortable bed adorned with cushions and aircon mounted on the wall and a closet. The mini library can be converted into an auxiliary bed if need arises and the support furniture upholstered to become a bench which can be used as a study or a reception table. The girl's bedroom also features a glass shower cubicle, an L counter made in a compact tone that guarantees better use of space, a mirror in its entire length, and a garden seat which works as an area of beauty and personal hygiene. The boys' suite is themed on the old passenger trains and their charming cabins materialize in a large bunk bed with built-in beds and an upper space with futons that invite a lot of fun. A large central free area was left so that the room also favors meeting friends, creative exercises, and play activities. With blue big floors and black cabinets, the boys' bathroom plays with playful elements present in the niches and in the sink basin, which produces a minimalist radio line. The generously proportioned master bedroom features a comfortable double bed, a sitting area, an air conditioner, a wooden furniture, and hardwood floors, which bring warmth to the room. The deluxe master bathroom features a glass shower cubicle, double sink bathroom vanity with a large mirror and a large bathtub. The wooden staircase connecting the two floors has dimmable lighting and the highlight goes to the pictures on the wall that borders the stairs. The library and home office combines functionality and aesthetics by accommodating a large collection of books as well as documents and family photos. The work table can be fitted between the counter and the bookcase, freeing up space for meditation or other activities. Next to the library is a bright, intimate family TV room that features a cozy couch with a throw pillows, creating an inviting room that leads directly out onto the standing balcony through the French doors where you can admire the view of the forest. Past the family room is a modern bathroom with cutouts on the walls and ceilings for the insertion of lighting and plots in shades of blue round-shaped mirror positioned asymmetrically in relation to the hall. The 20-foot studio and the playroom is a multifunctional space divided into four sectors, entertainment, study, leisure, and guest rooms. The sofa becomes a double bed or two single beds with the support of small tables and futons adapting to the use of space. The airy filmmaker's studio has hardwood floors, large windows that open to the landscape, integrating the interior of the property with nature, and below it, the solid wood bench made with a tree trunk acts as support. Plus hardwood flooring, the floors are finished with beautiful floor tiles, plus hardwood flooring, which gives the rooms a sleek, modern look. The garden converses with other environments and integrates harmoniously with the native forest. Irrelevant. The Zen space provides an environment for contemplation and escape from the stress of everyday life. The grooves of the rose shipping container walls are repainted and are visible throughout the exterior, which celebrates the industrial vibe of the design. The solar panels installed on the roof provide sustainable source of power for the house. We love everything about this amazing container house. Which part of this container building appeals to you the most? Kindly give us your opinion by posting in the comment section below. If you like this video as usual, give it a thumbs up and feel free to share it. You are encouraged to subscribe to these and more amazing weekly videos on shipping container living. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.